Salutations! I'm back with another Ina lore video. In this video, I wanted to point out a few striking similarities between the well-known Season 1 episode Extinction Party and the less well-known Dream Barbecue song Purge of It. Right off the bat, it's clear that there's a connection between the two. After all, Extinction Party and Purge Event are synonyms. However, there's yet another shocking similarity between the two videos. As noted by this user in my server, the background of Purge Event matches the wallpaper of the labyrinth in Extinction Party. Based on these two details alone, we can infer that the Labyrinth from Extinction Party will return in Dream Barbecue. But wait, there's more! In Dream Barbecue, we'll finally see the dangers that lurk in the Labyrinth. Let's start by addressing the elephant in the room. Barbecue Ina is not in good shape here. In addition to being in her chupacabra form, the one with the cracked green face, she is missing an arm. It appears she is not only in peril, but may have already been attacked. Additionally, it has been heavily suggested by this sticker, and outright confirmed via Patreon, that Mercy will return in Dream Barbecue. In her first appearance, she kept insisting that Season 1 Ina had to leave the labyrinth, but Ina misunderstood her message and continued forward. The real translation reads as follows. Wait, Ina, where are you going? You're not supposed to be here. Get out of here before I kick your ass. What? You stuffy fuck. Just run away and don't accept anything from people around here. The final message is rather ominous and has piqued fans' interests for years. And after such a long wait, we're finally getting an explanation in Dream Barbecue. Perhaps Mercy will attempt to get Barbecue Dina to leave the labyrinth as well, but she too will misunderstand and won't be as lucky as Season 1 Ina. What exactly the danger of the labyrinth is remains to be seen until Dream Barbecue, but it will likely pertain to the man in the background of the Purge event video. If I had to guess, he seems to be some sort of agent of chaos, like Bill Cipher but in DJ form. I mean, look at that smile. He's living for this. I don't trust him. And those are my thoughts on the connections between Extinction Event and Purge Party. If you have any other ideas, leave them in the comments. I hope y'all enjoyed this video, and I'll see you soon. Bye!